What is up everyone and welcome back to what is most likely the final episode of nice Wii in. Sports. You know what that means. I have finally obtained all 15 platinum medals and the last nice one in. that I have not done is surprisingly putting. It's somewhat surprising, somewhat not because the hardest one is target practice golf. Um, however, putting, there is, you can make no mistakes. You're given nice five hit. balls, and there's ten holes that you have to put in from certain distances and angles and such. And as you're seeing right now on your screen, I'm doing that. Um, and you can't miss a single ball. You have to get nice it all hit. first try. And um, I do that today. But in my personal opinion, this is the hardest. Um metal because you can't make any mistakes there's only a few um platinum medals where you can't make a mistake this is one hitting home runs is another one that one's really hard um, a lot of the platinum That's medals it. you have some sort of wiggle room whether it's you are given multiple lives whether it's if you mess up on one you're okay you can make it you can make a comeback you can like pick it up later make up ground whatever you want to call it this one is not the case same as hitting home runs same as returning balls in tennis. Nice I mean, there's hit. very few that you can't make any mistakes. And I think this is the hardest one. The power, the angles, the um, consistency um, is insane. And it's not as easy as bowling. Bowling, you get five lives with 20 lanes, and it's the same setup every time. Golf is different. Golf is very much like um, hitting the green golf. There are about three to four different versions nice of the holes you can get. Like, there are three different variations of hole seven, three different variations of hole eight. Like, there are variations of the holes, so you can't just watch a YouTube guide and figure out what angle and power to hit it at. Trust me, I loaded up three different videos of people hitting the platinum and had my own Google Docs made where I played a little bit and like made some notes on different holes and I used all four of those things to get my platinum medal attempt. Nice you hit. can call it fraudulent because if they had the same hole I copied and pasted what they did. Now granted I think it still is like you know it still counts because it still took me over an hour and 15 minutes it was almost an hour and a half uh, and even though you see it, you have to execute it. Golf is probably the hardest sport in Wii Sports because the consistency of the power on your golf club is not the same. I mean, I had to swing like three times just to barely get enough power, nice and then I almost didn't have the accuracy, and I was watching a YouTube video for that. Anyway, as you know with these videos, I never put m the winning attempt up front. And that broke my heart right there. I was 0.8 feet away from getting the platinum. That was the first time I made it to hole 10 with no errors in my session. And I did it one other time. And of nice course I hit it. the very next ball. I was jutted. I was so sad. But I knew I could hit it. That attempt showed me I could definitely do it. I just missed one ball. Sadly, that is not the platinum. Now... Let me go over tips and tricks. I always like to do that. The first hole is super simple. You're like two feet away. Okay, well, 6.9 feet apparently. And you just barely hit it straight. For some reason, my putt does not want to work. It's just being dumb. There we go. You just hit it straight nice barely, hit. about a dot, a dot and a half. The second one, regardless of what it looks like, you would want to tilt your thing right, you would think, by looking at it. But hole one and two nice are hit. straight shots. Hole three and four is when they start going left and right. So I have a downhill, three square, or 11.6 feet away, nice slope hit. right hill, so I kick it left, another three block, or 10.2 feet away, um, on a downhill slope to the left, so I kick it right. This one is very deceiving. You actually want to kick it more right than you think, because you think you want to like just kick it a little bit, and I almost missed nice it there, hit. and I kicked it way far right. Um, hole 5 and hole 6, that's when I started using my YouTube videos. Um, this one in particular, you want to go in between 
the um, first intersection and the hole. If you don't know what I mean by the first intersection, they all have squares. Um, and the first intersection is where uh, the squares nice meet. Hand. So, I hope that makes sense. I'll tell you when a first intersection does happen. Hole 6 is also weird. You want to go in between the first intersection and the hole again. And you want to have a little more power than you did in the previous one, I think. I think you want to have 2, right? You want to have just under 2, or right at nice 2, hit. and that should be fine. Hole 7, this one is very tricky because usually hole 7 is a straight shot. It's just a very, very long straight shot. This one is curved up. Uh, it's a downhill curve into an uphill curve that's more intense. So what you want to do is kick it a little bit left. You don't want to go in between because you might kick it a little too far left. So you want to kick it about one fourth, one quarter, one fourth to the left with um, about two and a half dots. See, that puts it nice in the middle. Hit. The video I saw put it in between, and they barely made it. Hole 8, this one's kind of tough because it's a right hill curve to your right, or it's an uphill curve to your right, and then all the way at the flag, it's on a hill, but it's not, like, super curved. It's kind of weird. You want to kick it barely to the left, almost at the intersection. It's not quite in between. I mean, I, I would say it's in between, actually. It's not, like, on the intersection. I don't know barely nice got hit. that one. I was so relieved when that went in. I did not think it was going in. Hole 9. This one is very, very tricky. It's on a really, really tall hill, and you want to barely kick it right. You want um, to kick it to the right where the ball is just beside the hole because the hill is not as intense as you think. It, it really isn't. It looks so massive, and you think you want to kick it like three or four squares over um, but you don't you just you just want to go barely to the right and I'm trying to line it up I'm using the video right now I'm like, okay is this correct this guy has it right here and now I'm trying to get the power okay um, so the game gives you a suggested uh, it says two and a half dots and I'm gonna try and do a little more um, because if you use the game suggested thing with this uh, two and a half dots is actually going to ruin the momentum The more power you have the less effect a curve has so if a hill is curved crazy If you give it more power it won't affect it as much nice If you add less power a curve is going to affect it crazily now hole 10 the one that I just Got gutted on this one's a little different. It's a straight shot, but there's a hole now intersection. Here's what I mean count one two three three blocks not including the block um, that my ball is on all right so one two three at the top of the third square I almost do the intersection you see what I mean it's kind of like on the corner of the square that's what I mean by intersection um if you can get this platinum medal it is a big relief again because you can't screw up you um, are given five lives, but the only time the five lives matter is if you can cup in the ten and then you get gold. So you just got to go undefeated, um, know the power and the angles. I say everything up to hole five is super duper easy. One and two are straight shots. Three and four are slight angle changes. Five and six can be difficult, but they also can be easy. It depends on the whole... Uh, that you get and then seven is usually easy. I got the weird hole seven where it's um, on two different hills Hole seven is usually just a straight shot like you give it like two and a half to three power and you can just shoot it straight um, Hole eight nine and ten are obviously the hardest you almost need to go two and a half to three to three and a half dots on all of these as you can see right now I'm just trying to get the perfect power because I screwed this up last time and there was another attempt that I didn't show you where the same thing happened. I got to hold 10 and the reason I didn't get the platinum was because I miss, I, I did the miss, uh, I mispowered my shot. Uh, and by that, by I mispowered my shot, I mean the Wiimote wasn't stable enough to give me the same shot. As you can see, I'm trying to go for three and a half dots, but I want to hit it twice in a row because as you can see, I'm hitting three and a half and then I'm hitting like three. See? Three and a half and three. 
three and a half. Okay, I want to hit it again. Three and a half. I hit three and three quarters. So I'm like, okay, three and a half. It's a little extra, but it was just nice the hit. right amount of power. If I actually did three and a half, Challenge I'm not clear. sure I would have made that hole in. And I still might only have 14 out of 15 platinum medals. But there you have it. You earned a I'm dead serious. Medal. Use my video. Use other videos. Um, and see if you get just good whole RNG. You could have a whole 10, a whole 8, a whole 6 that none of your videos have. But the more videos and the more different videos you have of people getting this platinum, the more likely you are to have um, the exact same whole 7 as me or something. Um, now you guys can call me cheater, you can call it a fraudulent platinum, but the fact of the matter is I have 15 platinum medals and no one can take that away from me. I hope you guys enjoyed the return of Wii Sports and I think this series is officially over. Thanks for watching.